Hey guys, uh, Mr. Stock here. It is Thursday and we're doing day two of NaNoWriMo. A um, couple of quick announcements. The first one is your homework all through the month of November is to go going to be to read for 20 minutes. I want you to read a book, good book. Any book that is interesting you, you should be doing that reading at home. Okay, Spend some time uh, reading a book. I mean, whether it's uh, sitting on your bed and reading, or you know, sitting in the backyard if it's a little warmer out, um, or you know, after school, just sitting out uh, in the commons and reading. I, I don't care where you're reading, but get that reading done. I love reading a good book. Okay. My next announcement is I'm going to kick off something today called gratitude snaps. What gratitude snaps are is it's a chance to showcase something that you are thankful for. So the way it works is, it's very simple. <laughs> Excuse me. So, uh, gratitude snaps, you are going to take a picture of something you are thankful for every day. It could be something at school, it could be something at home, it could be a person, it could be a thing, um, but something that you are super grateful for, we're gonna do it every day between now and uh, Thanksgiving break, um, just to showcase what we're thankful for. I'm gonna have a spot where you guys are gonna be posting them uh, to share with others um, at some point, and I may sh post a few of them on our Instagram if you want me to. Um, but you are going to earn points for your guild for each one that you do. So uh, I'll show you an example today in class after we're done with this announcement video. Um, so it should be fun. I'm doing the same thing. I'm actually doing two sets. I'm doing one for here and one just of my personal ones that things that I'm grateful for that I post on Twitter. Um, yeah, so it should be fun. Uh, the way you can do it is you're going to use, um, you can use pic collage on your iPad, take a picture, maybe put some words around it, um, some things that makes you think of. So, uh, last but not least, we have our quote of the day. This is a really good one. I enjoy this one. Um, it says, turn your wounds into wisdom by Oprah Winfrey. And what I like about that one is it basically means that, you know, bad things are going to happen. It's unavoidable, unfortunately. That's just part of life. Sometimes bad things happen. And you got two options. One, you can dwell on it and you can let it make you sad and you can let it consume you. Or the other thing is you can learn from it. When something bad happens, it's okay to be a little sad about it, but then use that as a learning opportunity. Sometimes it's that maybe the person who made you sad, you shouldn't be around them anymore. Maybe it's that you did something that you shouldn't have and you had a consequence for it and so you're gonna learn from that mistake. So always use every opportunity, good or bad, as a learning experience. That's all I've got for today. All right, guys, until next time, book it forward and be awesome. Bye.